Hello everyone, welcome back to All Things Sam. I'm not gonna sugarcoat it, it's been a stressful couple of days, um, honestly weeks. I'm in the middle of midterms, um, so I decided to make a short video about my skincare. I feel like this has been a really highly requested video. Um, I also feel like it is something I've been wanting to talk about for a while. Um, for those of you who don't know, I have oily to dry skin, which means either my skin is super oily or it's super dry. So it's really hard sometimes to figure out what to do with that combo. Um, I'm gonna put these things that I am mentioning in this video out. Um, and I will make sure I link them down below in the description. Um, this does not mean they're going to be the best for you, the worst for you. I really highly recommend seeing a facial specialist, um, an esthetician, a dermatologist based on what their personal needs are. Um, yes, I am in my bathroom right now, but I'm going to be going through this step-by-step -step process of how I clean wash my face, what I do for skincare, um, as well as just giving out some of the things that I personally use. Um, as you can see, my skin isn't perfect. I do have acne sometimes. Um, right now I'm having a really bad breakout because I've been stressing. But um, things like drinking plenty of water, working out regularly, eating good food, getting enough sleep, um, reducing your stress can all help with clearing up your skin, as well as a super sick skincare routine. So let's get into the video. Here we go. Okay, so the first thing that I do, which I already did, um, I like to put my hair up in like whatever this is, and then I take this headband. I got it from Twenty One for like two ninety two years ago. Um, it has some things on it, but I feel like it's the best way to keep my hair from getting wet. Um, if I'm about to do my makeup and my hair is done and I need to wash my face really quick, I'll just make sure that um, the edges are secure. So I think like this is a really good face mask to control everything going on. Um, so the first thing that I've been using recently, um, so these products are going to be from Dermalogica. Um, this is the brand name for you guys to see. Um, and so what I've been starting with is a pre-cleanse. So what this does is it is an oily base. It's a deep cleansing oil that melts impurities and makeup from skin. Um, so you use it on a dry face, dry hands. It's like an oil. You put it on your face. It attracts all the oil that's stuck in your pores. And then you take water and you rinse it and it turns white when it's getting all the impurities out of your skin. And then um, you wash it off and your face actually feels really clean. It's a really weird combination because I don't like the feeling of putting oil on my face, but I like to feel like after I use it. So. I'm gonna go ahead and apply this and show you guys what it looks like, and then we'll go from there. Okay, so right now I'm just taking this and putting some on my hand, and then moving it around my face. You can't really see it, um, or it's like it's shiny, but it's not like suds or anything. So I'm just gonna massage this into my skin, let it get real good in there. Um, I feel like when I do my makeup and I take my makeup off and I use this, it does get my face makeup off really well. So if you wear a lot of face makeup like me, um, it's great for cleaning your skin. Uh, it's also good for sensitive skin, like it feels really soothing to my skin, um, especially when it does go through the dry spells. So I think that's really, really important. Okay, so now I'm taking some warm water and I'm gonna just mix it in. And you can kind of see that it is changing colors just a little bit. Um, it turns into like this white substance um, and that's just bringing any dirt or anything oil on your face that it um, is mixing with and pulling it out of your skin so that you can get it out of your skin. Um, it's going to start feeling cleaner, it's going to start feeling like a soapy substance, more, less like an oil. Um, and then once I completely just rinse my face really quick, I'll be able to notice the difference in it feeling super clean. Okay. So I just rinse that off after I massage that into my skin. Um, the next thing that I have been using, um, so originally after this step I would use my um, same brand Dermalogica and I would use the Breakup Clearing Foaming Wash um, as the Clear Start and so this is what it looks like. This is the bottle. I'm actually out of it. This is an empty bottle. Um, but my skin therapist that I see for facials recommended that I start using the special cleansing gel. It's a little bit more powerful um, and it is also by the exact same brand. Like I said, I will link everything that I'm using down in the description below. Um, and then I also like to use the Daily Microfoliant, um, same brand. This is what it looks like. This is a small one. I get this for $15 at Ulta. 
and I will also link this down in the description. Um, I'm going to use this. I usually use a brush and my hand, and I mix it in with water, and then put it on my skin. So I will show you guys um, what it looks like once it's on my skin, once I have it on my skin. Um, and basically what this does, um, the microfoliant, um, it is an exfoliant for your skin. It eats away the dead skin cells and bacteria and anything that you have on your skin. Um, I let it sit for three to seven minutes. That's the estimated time that they recommend. Um, and basically the enzymes just eat away and make your skin look, feel, whole better. Not be so oily, but not to be so dry. Um, so it works really well for me. So um, let me go ahead and put this on. This mask substance almost but it's not and it's like exfoliant um while I'm waiting for this to just hang I'm gonna tell you guys about my other stuff I use that I'm not showing in this video um, one of those is I am religiously a fan of lush face masks um, I will put in the description some of my favorite face masks I like to use um, not only do I think face masks have really good benefits for your skin as far as clearing up your skin and having healthy skin, but I like to do them to relax. I like to take bubble baths a lot. Um, say what you may about bubble baths, that's fine. But um, yeah, I'm a super big fan of that and relaxation and de-stress and keeping your mental health all good. So um, yeah, after this, I'm going to wash this all off. Then I'm going to use my special cleansing gel mentioned before. So there's the bottle for that. Um, and then once I do that, I'm going to go into some other products that I like to use. Um, I'm going to first use my rose water facial toner from Trader Joe's. Um, this is what this looks like. It's super cheap. I will also link this down in the description. Um, and then I will use my Clear Start Skin Soothing Hydrating Lotion from the same brand that I've been using for everything, um, Dermalogica. So, uh, yeah, I love this. Um, sometimes if I don't use this to um, soothe my face, I will use serum that has vitamin C and vitamin B in it um, that also helps um, I try to do that when my skin is more dry because it gets the essential oils back on my face and gets it back to its healthy awesome self um, the other thing I do recommend for people with oily skin is I use the formula 10.0 or 10. Dot, yeah 0.6 so totally clean anti-blemish pads um, this is what they are right here um, I get these at Ulta as well and these are just little pads um, and what they do is they help control the oil and shine on your face um, they do have salicylic acid in them so they are an acne treatment um, so I would advise you to use them only if you're having breakout or severely oily skin like I do um, all right let's get this off my face and let's continue Okay, so I just took off my exfoliant. Um, I am now going to proceed with my special cleansing gel. Um, I just usually put water on my face. I put about a pea-sized dot of it in my hand and then moisturize it into my face. Super refresh after 
everything that just happened. Um, I usually do my skincare routine in the shower, so I will do my shampoo, my conditioner, skincare routine, wash my body, rinse my shampoo, or, or rinse my um, conditioner, excuse me, come out of the shower, then do my rose water. And then after my rose water is dry, I do my moisturizer. Um, I didn't spray too much rose water, so it is actually completely dry on my face. Um, I'm gonna take this Skin Soothing Hydrating Lotion um, by Clear Start from Derm Dermalogica. Dermalogica, excuse me. And I'm going to just take a, another really small amount of this and put it on my face just to soothe it. Um, again, I only really use this one if my face is super, super dry. Um, I don't feel like my face gets super oily with this moisturizer. I think it's really important to moisturize, um, especially because of my combo skincare that I have, um, or type of skin, excuse me, um, it is late, um, but I think, um, everything in this that I've outlined, um, they're all really important things, um, I believe that skincare is really important, um, I have found a personal love for caring for myself when it comes to my skin, um, and I'm very thankful that I have a routine that kind of works, um, I can't really prevent that I get stressed out, or if I'm not eating right, or if I'm not doing the things, other things outside of washing my face, everything to, um, prevent acne, but I do the best I can, I'm only human, um, I hope you guys found this video informative, if you liked it, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and please comment down below what other videos you would like to see from all the things Sam, I would love some suggestions so I can give you guys the content that you guys want. Um, other than that, thank you guys for watching and I will talk to you guys next week.